Hi, this is Sir Stillwater. In this video, I'm going to continue my great building series and talk about the Deal Castle. Uh, it's a pretty cool looking building, um, but it's big. And let's go ahead and talk about why I don't have this built in any of my worlds at this point. And uh, eventually I will, but why I don't have any today, what it offers, and what my thoughts are on that. So let's check it out. Pretty cool looking though. So. Okay, let's see. I am showing you this picture here. I am over on uh, forgevampires.phantom.com. Kind of a cool resource, no affiliation, just a cool resource I like to look at. Okay, so as I mentioned, it's a big building. It's 7 by 7 I mean, that thing's monstrous. Uh, especially in colonial age, because you're trying to do stuff. Everything else is getting a little bit bigger to build. Um, you're, as you get to those eras, you're kind of, each era, the buildings kind of orient um, differently. They kind of go left to right or right to left. Each era, they kind of alternate, so you kind of have to play a little bit of game in your placement. So sacrificing the 7x7 seven seven space on the on the map um, is a consideration, in my opinion. This is all my opinion, of course. Uh, so this is a Colonial Age construction cost, 290, 230, 340, 180, and 210. 340 wire, which is kind of an interesting one. Why is wire so expensive in a Colonial Age building that's made out of, made out of stone? Uh, I don't know, it just doesn't really quite add up. I mean, I could see if there's other things that they used, um, I don't know, that had a higher number, but that doesn't really make sense. And <laughs> just, I'm just having fun with it now, but uh, let's see, its properties, uh, the values that it gives you, uh, in my opinion, aren't that great for what you're giving up space-wise, and um, FPs to build it. So you're getting some metals, metal production, the daily metal production, and you're getting some daily guild support pool, um, and then also you get some defense boost. So at level one, you're getting a 3% defense boost, which really by colonial age, you, you may be getting defense boost from other stuff. You, unless you're getting attacked a lot um, or whatever, it's really not, I don't think that 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 great. Uh, guild support pool used to mean a lot more, I think, uh, earlier on in the game's evolution because guild support pool was used for guild versus guild and uh, guild rankings and all types of other stuff. Um, I just don't think it has that much, you know, weight like it used to. And then uh, metals, uh, you get 40 per day. And then by the time you're getting to Colonial Age, the cost to unlock real estate using metals um, is getting a little bit higher. So you're, you're picking up 40 a day, so that's 210 a week. I guess it adds up, but um, there's going to come a, come a point when you get start to level those out, and it's going to get real expensive. It's going to take a lot of time for this to add up. Add up. At level 10, it costs you're talking 740 FPs to build it, uh, but your defense boost is 30%, and you get 30 support pool and 170 medals uh, per day. So, um, in my opinion, it's not a building that I have placed anywhere, um, and that's. I have tons of blueprints for them because it's colonial age and you, you just get those organically. Um, I don't pursue this building. I have those stacked up. So when the day comes, because I want to build my full set of all great buildings, um, I'll place it. But uh, until um, I got to get pretty deep in the barrel before I start to consider placing a deal castle. So that's my opinion. Uh, everybody's got their own. It's a cool looking building though, <laughs> on that note. So that's all I've got on this one. Thanks for watching. Um, if you like what you're seeing, um, or if you want to, you know, kind of help the channel grow so other people can, can, um, you know, hopefully benefit from some of this information, uh, please go ahead and like and subscribe and I'll let you as, um, link down below for the, uh, we'll call it, uh, Sir Stillwater's microphone, uh, new microphone fund at Amazon. It's an Amazon affiliate just for uh, a generic affiliate link um, that if anybody uses, and I, I may get a couple couple cents from Amazon to help uh, prepare for a new microphone someday. So thanks for watching. More buildings coming and more general gameplay videos coming. So thanks for watching. Have a great day. See you in the next one.